Okay, let's have a look at example 9.9, frictional power. Okay, so we have a half a kilogram uh, wooden block moving at one meter per second. Its inertia is half a kilogram and it comes to rest. Okay, so what is the energy diagram? Well, the kinetic energy drops. There's no change in potential, no change in uh, source energy, but of course the thermal energy increases. So all the kinetic energy gets converted into thermal and there's no work done on the system. Okay, very good. So what is the average rate at which thermal energy is generated? So the rate and energy, rate and energy means we're looking for power. The rate at which thermal energy is generated and it says the average rate. So we're looking for something like this. E, so delta E thermal over delta T, okay? So, um, as you can see, we need to calculate two things. We need to calculate this delta E thermal. How do we do that? By, we do that by calculating delta K, because e, delta E thermal is the negative of delta K, right? Delta K plus delta E thermal must equal zero. So we know how to calculate delta E thermal. We calculate the initial kinetic energy. I just want to show you here. So the initial kinetic, e remember, um, so delta E thermal is the negative of delta K. So the initial kinetic energy is given by this. You can just calculate it there. Okay. So delta E thermal is 0.25. Okay. So now we've got, we've got this part, delta E thermal, the top part is 0.25 joules. But now we need to know, we need to determine what is the total time traveled from that point to that point. And I'm not going to go through this. It's here on the screen. This is chapter three stuff. You determine, um, you've got the initial velocity, final velocity. Um, <clears throat> you can use this equation, substitute it into this equation, and you can determine your total time. Okay, I'm not going to go through this. This is chapter three. And you calculate your average power is 0.25 divided by one, <clears throat> and you get 0.25 watts. Okay, so that is the average rate at which thermal energy is generated.